Now we're going to look specifically at calculating the area for a triangle. So this video will explain how we get the formula for it and why it's actually used. If I have a triangle, as shown here, and I want to know what the area of it is, I know that I want to know how much fits inside it in this shape, in this flat shape. So what I can do is, if I think about, if I duplicated this triangle, and then I just rotate it around and put it against itself, I've got two lots of this triangle, and notice what shape it makes, I suddenly have a square. And we know that the area of a square is equal to its base times its height. So if this triangle is actually just half of a square, that means that if I take the area, which I know is base times height, and now if I just divide it by 2, I get half of my square, which is a triangle. So therefore, the area of a triangle is just half of base times height, where this would be the base from the length of this end, and the height is just this side, or this side here, height. Now that we've watched that video, this is just a recap. So the area of a triangle, as we talked about, is just half of the base times height because of the relationship between a triangle and a square, where a triangle is just half of the square. So have a go at these questions here. You can either pause it now and write on the screen or do it in your math books. The answers will appear shortly.